Hey everyone, Living in Furnace here, and I am up the creek without a paddle. <laughs> in a sense, I threw away my great uh, flame blade, uh, or whatever it's called, and <clears throat> I'm gonna be kind of chilly for a while. But luckily, I have plenty of hearts to sustain myself. You know, I'm a big, uh, big-bellied link. I am. I'm full, I am prepared, I'm like an Eskimo, eating lots of fat, getting strong, so I can brave the wilderness, I think, <laughs> more or less. Oh dear, that's, can't, can't shield surf on that. It is kind of fun to hop around along this. You know, it's easy enough, like, if you're really good at shield surfing, you can go along this little ridge. Oh, there's the... dinner all again. I don't think we're gonna catch up to him, or it, or her, or whatever. But, uh... Would be cool to do so. But I already got... I already got a scale from it. I guess I've just been here so long that time's just passed by. <laughs> day by day. Blow that up. Haha. <laughs> oh, I should have run it over. Uh, these two are gonna keep shooting at me. I don't have any other arrows. I don't want to use up my bomb arrows. Did I just have one left? I know I lo I know I used quite a few, but there are some here and there. I could, you know, I could go through more enemy encampments, but um, I don't know. It's just they just don't really seem worthwhile. It's nice to get some arrows, but if I have to fight a bunch of enemies to get them, well, there's certain kinds that you don't have to defeat all the enemies. You can just manage to get your way to the top. I think there's one of those up ahead. As you know, this is uh, after the recording. We are off for quite an interesting adventure this time. Right now, I'm heading down the road to get to uh, to another stable, and uh, well, things are things are gonna happen. I'll just tell you that much. This is not one of those things. Just a bunch of enemies by some ruins, you know. Pretty pretty well situated, you know. They're looking out, guarding. That's pretty cool, but... Yeah, I don't care. I do have to admit, this world is really well designed with the enemy placements and all that. It's not random, you know. Like, with some games, there's just, like... There's, there's like, random placement of, uh, things, you know? Uh, I guess I can maybe bomb? No, I have to shoot an arrow. Oh, uh, well. Oh, I have, oh, I had ten. Oh, okay. I guess I got some more. Yes, I see your acorn, Korok. Oh, I'm so sorry. Uh, sc sc Spot. I almost said Scott. Scott is an actual name. Spot is an, a an animal name. I don't know why, but I'm just feeling kind of off today. I've had trouble sleeping the past few days, and I got a, a decent sleep, I guess, but... I don't know. I guess I'm... You know, getting back to speed, you know? Just like the temperature is warming back up again. Uh, oh my god, I almost got <laughs> I almost got hit by that boulder. So funny that, that boulders are just kind of there, rolling down. Yeah, you see, that's one of those encampments, like... If you can manage to climb up, which, I mean, you can, you might get shot a couple times, but if you run up, you can get some 
pretty cool stuff, you know? Get some arrows or whatever. Maybe a good weapon. Sometimes you just get a bow, but... Beetle, what are you doing out here? The shrine is over here. A bit far from the... Hey! Spot. Spot, do not stop and shove your hooves into the ground like that. That is... That is... Not only annoying, but it is also disturbing. And please don't go so fast. I have... I have the desire to put you back in the stable for your bad behavior. Okay, really, it's just because I didn't really need it anymore. This area uh, is uh, a mountainous area. <clears throat> As it is. Grasslands, desert, ocean, jungle, ice world, mountains, uh, sky, fire, world, boss. Yes, so this is, so as I mentioned, uh, Cass is one of the, um, Rito, and his village is just right around here. Mm. I'm not really in the mood to hear a story. I have adventures to go on. But thank you, thank you, sir, for keeping them in mind. At, wait. I, I, you know what, that might be something different. That might actually be a shrine quest, so I probably should return to that. I, you know, because the odd thing, you might have noticed, the, the shrine radar is not going off here. There might be a thing I have to do. I don't know what. So I'll have to talk to Cass, get around, get back to him. I have not recorded uh, that sort of thing, but I'll try that out. Um, maybe. Maybe sometime. Wow, those are... Oh, those are uh, shadows of birds. Marching along. Apparently there's an enemy there. I didn't see it. I see no evil, but I apparently could have heard some evil. So, I think I detected a shrine around here. Just, um... Just gotta find it. It over here? <coughs> Where's the uh, enemy base? Ah, there, in the horizon there, you, you saw it like that beak looking thing is actually Rito Village. It's a nice uh, perch like thing in a city that is like a perch, a, uh, a nest of sorts. Pretty cool. You know, it's a nice, natural sort of thing. Um, yeah, there is a shrine around here. Every, um, every, like, city, like, every, every, oh. Uh, every area with a divine beast has a pretty interesting city. I guess they are all, like, unnatural of sorts but um, you know Rito have um, what's it called uh, you know, they, they use wood and cloth around that rock structure so it looks interesting but it is more natural than say well <laughs> you haven't seen it uh, in this playthrough but uh, the Zora uh, up the Zora River they they now they have just an amazing city. A, I think it's even called a domain, as it was in Ocarina of Time. So here's a shrine. I dropped down, but apparently I could have just <laughs> walked along. Down in the, uh, in the, uh, place that, what's it called? 
the canyon, the Grand Canyon. <laughs> Apparently, it is a, it is it is like actually a Grand Canyon. It is very deep. You know, I went down it earlier to get Dinral's scale. Well, that reminds me, I gotta get around to getting that scale to a uh, sanctuary kind of place, a spring, like with, uh, like with, uh, Faroche, yeah. And I think there is, like, w there, there are, like, one or two more, um, shrines that I have to get to around there. So... Sooner or later, I'll be heading around there. Ugh. <coughs> I have my spoon, but I should probably use uh, a sledgehammer. So I'm guessing I have to use stasis and push the, uh, the barrel fast enough. Get a good lot of momentum. I guess I'm... I might be a little too relaxed today. Um, I even had an interview, interview and it was... It was okay, but I, I don't think I, I don't think I really had a lasting impression, you know. It's uh, I don't know. I've been kind of feeling kind of depressed lately, but I'm feeling kind of better, as I said, picking up. Ah, that does it. Uh, what is... Okay, so I guess I gotta... Really push this onto that. Probably need stasis. Probably unable to... To get it, um... I'm probably unable to, like, actually physically push it with my own two arms and hands. Yeah, and I need this big ball to go onto that platform. And switch. There's that. Oh, a weapon. Uh, do I really want that? I don't really have anything I want to... Well, I guess I'll get rid of the hammer. I, I, I use it a couple of times already. Yep. Should I... Wait, should I throw that one away? Oh, I guess I did throw it away. I, I forgot. Yeah. Yeah, I mean... Ele electric weapons can do the stuff that... Ice weapons can do. Although there are fire enemies, and an icy weapon would really help out. Well, now I regret that. Oh well. I really didn't use that frost spear a whole lot. <laughs> and I should not have thrown away that um, hammer. Alright, so the trick here is that you gotta get the barrels that do show back up if they fall off the edge. Um, you gotta get them to hit the A? What the heck was that? Uh, you gotta get them to hit the um, button. As, well, I mean, as it was before, you know. This is, uh, this is quite the shrine. Oh wow, you can even hear the, uh, the Thunder Blade get its electricity back. Pretty cool. <laughs> I 
Man, it is disturbing to see all that electricity. Wait, that way? No. Ah, man. I got the right. I got I got it going the wrong way. <clears throat> the funny thing how this shrine works. It's all these, you know, separate puzzles. Alright, get this one go going at a good speed. And... Ah. Uh, do it again. Man, this is... You know, this was kind of fun to begin with, but now, not so much, really. Alright, that's a good direction. Make sure it's nice and strong, and we are good. Now, what do we have here? Huh. I don't know. I don't know about a bow. So further. Oh, it shoots faster. Yeah, that's the thing. Yeah, I don't know about that. Um, what's it called? The the Dorito test is more towards that. 